Good morning, this morning I'm going to show you how um, to create a Kaleidoscope image in style game in haste. What you first need to do is go into your play store and you need to search for Adobe Capture. It looks like that, the black background with the white writing. Okay, I've already downloaded it, it is free. So I'm just going to bring it up on my phone. Um, Adobe Capture. And along the bottom is a toolbar um, and it's got loops, it's got colours, it's got shapes but the one that you're going to be using today is um, the one that says patterns. So you click on patterns and what you can do then is you can select, you can either take a new photograph or you can select a photograph that you've already taken. So as we do natural forms I'm going to go back to a photograph that I took um, the other week when we were doing about photographers. Um, and I'm going to select a picture of one of the flowers that I took. I'm going to go for the pink fuchsia at the bottom there. Okay. So what you do is you just press the tick to say that that is the photograph that you're happy with. And then you can slide it up and down. You can rotate it. You can zoom in. Okay. You can rotate the picture around to get different parts of it. Okay, and just keep swirling it around, zooming it in, bringing it back until you're happy with the pattern that you can see at the top. When you're happy with the pattern, you press the blue arrow in the top right hand corner, okay, and you can press save. And it will save it to uh, the Creative Cloud library. Now, if you want to have it saved on your phone, what you need to do is you need to press the little um, cross in the bottom left hand corner. And it will bring up all the pictures that you've made. And now, as you can see, I've had a good play around on this. So I've got lots of patterns. I'm just waiting for the most recent ones to load up at the top. Okay, so I'm going to click on the one that I've just made. The one from the fuchsia. Okay, and I want to save it to my phone. Okay, now you can, you can edit it first if you want to by pressing the little edit button. Um, but if you're happy with it, um, you can save it to your phone if you want just by clicking on the little bottom left hand corner um, with the three dots joined up with the lines and you can just press save to device and it will save it okay now if I come back out and just to check that it has gone to my phone if I go to my uh, gallery There we go, it just takes a minute to load up and you can just press on the one that you've just saved. You can edit it if you want to, so you could zoom in by pressing the edit button at the bottom. And I'm going to zoom in on one of the patterns. Now, just to make sure that it's central, I'm just making sure they're using that grid system, that all the patterns that I can see is central, and I'm going to press save to save it as a smaller tile. Okay. So have a play around with it, have a little bit of fun with it. If you don't want to use the Adobe Capture, there is a way to do it on your um, Instagram. So we go into Instagram. Okay, you can see that I've done one there. And I did that just by simply um, going to my gallery, clicking on the layout button, the one that gives you the options of having lots of different, go back, lots of different pictures. So I'm gonna click on the one with four pictures, okay? What I'm gonna do is I'm simply gonna mirror image those pictures and flip them. Okay, so I'm gonna flip them. And you can see that as you flip them, it can sort of go around, it spreads out, so it's um, sort of symmetrical. Okay, you could flip them again, or you could mirror image them. You want to so have a play around but remember that the most important thing is that it is symmetrical okay and you can edit it as you would do normally on instagram so have a have a bit of fun have a play around with it guys send us your pictures we look forward to maybe try and do sort of several different ones perhaps five different ones have a play with the adobe capture um, app and see what you can do perhaps you might find something that you can do that we've not discovered have fun bye